So um, we're almost done with the 2022 half of basketball season. Mm -hmm. How do you think um, your performance was in this first half so far? Uh, I think we, as a team we've done really well and I mean we're off to a great start and I think we're one game away from you know having a really good start to the conference season and a game that we can really go into conference feeling confident in ourselves. Yeah so it's a big um, name opponent for tomorrow for tomorrow I keep thinking that it's today for some reason <laughs> don't ask me why but um, how are you guys feeling heading into this matchup? Yeah, you know, playing an SEC team is never easy. Um, and so we've spent a lot of time kind of going over them, prepping for them, and we've really focused on ourselves this week and just things that we can get better at. Um, and so I think we're in a good spot um, going into tomorrow's game. Now, what are some of those things that you guys have been focusing on getting better at? Yeah, I think most of them on the defensive end, you know, just getting stops and rebounding the ball. Um, and then we've worked a lot on getting our turnover numbers down um, and just being more efficient with the ball. Yeah, um, it's been almost a week, good week and a half since the last game. Mm -hmm. uh, what does the practice schedule look like in that time? They have week in finals. Did anything cut off at all, or has it been just the um, same schedule? You know, after our last game last Sunday, I think it was. <laughs> it's been a minute. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, we took two days um, just to kind of regroup, um, kind of focus on exams that we had. Um, and we were on an 11 day stretch, I think, in a row. So having those two days was kind of nice for everyone to kind of, you know, regroup. Um, but then we've been going since then. Um, and, you know, just really trying to focus on things that we can get better at and not having to focus on an opponent for the whole time. Um, so it's been good for us to kind of grow for sure, not just scouting every team. Yeah, yeah. If you look around the roster, um, leading into this nine and two star, it's been it's been a lot of you transfers. What what's made that transition so easy for all you guys to to lead to success? Yeah, I think it starts with the coaches, and then it kind of the team in general. And they've been really adaptable to um, me and Lisha and just kind of how we play. And I think we've gelled really well. Um, with the team just kind of working off each other um, and so they look I mean they look to get us the ball and put us in positions where we can be successful um, and I think it just kind of brings the team together. You know transferring is always like such a hard thing to do but um, looking at the first half of the whole season so far what mm -hmm. has been um, a couple of your favorite moments like from doing with this program? Uh, you know I'd say there's a lot um, I think the feeling that you get when you just run out of Mackey for the first time is like unreal and something that I haven't experienced. And then, you know, like hearing close games, um, I know we lost the Maryland game at the buzzer, but that game and the atmosphere and playing such a tough opponent, um, it was just cool to be a part of that. Um, and I think, I mean, I'm definitely glad that I transferred here and I've had so many great moments with the team and with the coaches. and. Just looking forward to more in the Big Ten. Awesome. Sorry.